guys, welcome back. Today we will be seeing how to use ChatGPT and prepare your professional looking PowerPoint presentation within no time. So for that first, let's go to ChatGPT. So I have to uh, select a topic on which I have to make a presentation. So uh, today I will take a topic, let's take cloud computing. Uh, let me give a good prompt. Please at a professional cloud computing expert. Hey, please act like a professional cloud computing expert. I want to present cloud computing basics or oh, what's wrong with it? Basics. PowerPoint presentation in my uh, college. Please help me prepare at least eight slides with key points and a brief uh, explanation of each. Please keep it professional looking and use simple words which do not sound like AI okay uh, what else I think this should be good let me hit enter and now let's see this is the content which looks good slide one slide two slide three fine cool now again if we uh, just copy paste this content one by one it will take a lot of time right so let's do one thing uh, now comes the main hack generate a vb script for the same so that can copy it to the repeat powerpoint okay so this is the VB script which uh, we will be using to create a powerpoint presentation within no time now i have to go to powerpoint presentation okay once you open powerpoint blank presentation okay, let me maximize it okay so after that you have to go to tools macro and visual basic editor as you can see over here so last time i had made a short form uh, short form video in which i had shown this uh, technique but many people had questions or many people couldn't locate where exactly this vb editor is so all we have to do is we have to go to tools macro and then vb editor now this is a mac system so for windows it might be slightly different so you have to uh, locate it but it should be fairly easy just search for tools macro and vb editor so once we click on it we should be able to see an empty uh, box over here with some blank area and then one project name vba project so we have to right click and select insert module so once we click on module we should be able to see this blank screen over here so now we are going to paste the same code whatever we copied from chat gpt so i pasted it over here and then we have to click on display icon which you can see over here small one so once i click on that i should be able to uh, see this small prompt box it says create cloud computing presentation so this name it has taken from the uh, vb script so i will just click on the run once i click that what do i have there you go i'm having this presentation ready see so everything is ready for me now, if you want to create a little bit more customized version of your presentation, say for example, if you want to uh, edit some uh, information, right? So you can always go to chat GPT and input more things. Like say for example, explain, explain me uh, slide number four more and give more slide content. So 
now it will try to give you more content so that you can just go and copy paste over there uh, service models so infrastructure as a service platform as a service so now i'm having a little bit more points i can just copy then again go to a blank presentation slide number four and maybe i can just paste it over here below down again the styling the way you want also if you want to give a basic styling you can go to uh, design and then select whatever style you want so i like to keep it simple so maybe here and there we have and now there are a few things which we might want to uh, change so that we can always do come over here maybe give some nice design and yeah that's it so within no time our presentation is ready now we can insert some images if we want some graphs again we can take help of chat gpt ask more questions or uh, more explanations on some uh, certain points or certain slides and it can help you okay so i think that's it for this uh, video guys i think this was fairly simple and quick one uh, to make sure you follow all these steps properly and customize your powerpoint presentation the way you want in terms of design content key points uh, subheadings headings everything whatever you want you can do with the help of chat gpt and the vp script editor so yeah that's it see you in the next video keep rocking keep coding take care